today I'm going to show you how to glitch walk disc golf. So the best way to glitch walk disc golf is by holding your forward button the way you want to walk and letting go and picking back up the the disc. So you're going to keep on clicking your right trigger or your left trigger depending depending on how you walk. So you're going to be walking forward while also dropping and re-grabbing your disc. As you can see, it's pretty slow, but it is the most efficient way too. And there you go. Hole in one. Now, the second way you can also glitch walk is by picking it up and spin walking. Now, I'll probably do another video on spin walking another time, so if you just don't know how to do spin walking just yet, don't worry. And there you go. Now that one is pretty nauseating, so I wouldn't really recommend that one a whole lot, or even ever if you can avoid it, but the last one I do want to show you is the cart. Now the cart is the fastest way, but it's a lot more riskier than the other ones, since it could touch the floor by bugging out, but let me show you. And then just grab it out. Stroke two. There you go. Now, it's not a hole in one since you did have to pick it up and drop it in and then move it, but it does do the trick. Now, if you are on screen mode, you'll probably still be okay since screen mode players usually have it a lot easier with throwing the frisbees, so you wouldn't get something like that. It'll always be a lot more straighter. And if you are looking, to speed up the process the par of of disc golf lake is nine so you should be okay even if you don't want to do this all right editor jack here fun little fact the par of disc golf lake is negative zero it is not nine so i got that wrong but subscribe oh,